It's Merger Monday, and there's another big pharmaceutical deal in the news. Morning, Laura. Good morning, Paula. So um, this has been a big year for pharmaceutical deals in general, and this morning we have another one. So Merck uh, said that they had agreed to buy um, Cubis Pharmaceuticals. Uh, this is overall a $9.5 billion deal, but can you break down the numbers for us? Right. So the deal had an equity value of $8.4 billion. That includes $1.1 billion in debt. It represents a 35% premium over Cubis five-day trading, which was, it looks like it was $102 per share they d decided to pay. All right, and I believe that's an all-cash deal. A lot of these deals have been in uh, cash and stock, but this one is all cash. You know, earlier this year, we saw a lot of uh, what you might call financial engineering. There were these so-called tax inversion deals trying to take advantage of uh, loopholes, basically, in the U.S. tax law, and that was clamped down on. Um, uh, earlier, we saw deals like Forest Labs and Ireland's activists or Mallinckrodt buying Quest Core. So if they couldn't do that, what was the main um, impetus for this deal that was announced this morning? Well, Cubis is very strong in late stage antibiotics drugs. So as a result, it seems to be attractive to Merck, who is apparently looking for a suitor for quite some time, well, looking for a buy for quite some time. So this fits well into their portfolio. Right. And, you know, there's always the issue, I think you'll agree, that these companies always have problems with a number of their uh, lucrative drugs uh, falling out of patent protection. Isn't right. that correct? correct? Okay. Well, thanks very much. And that's, uh, we're here for the deal report.